Hi guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to run localhost on your PC. So localhost is basically where you can just see your website, um, your HTML website. So you have to type in localhost. I already have something installed, but it will take you here. Well, I don't have it on, but it refuses to connect, right? So if you just do that without downloading any specific software, it won't, um, work so you so you have to download zamp uh x a m p p um and go to the first uh site that pops up it's by apache apache friends and then you'll just press download zamp for windows it'll create a exe file and um yeah so you can just download it like that so first thing you have to do is go into zamp Zamp control panel, that's the name of it. And this is what it will look like. So you see all of these uh, Apache, MySQL, FileZilla, Mercury, Tomcat. So the thing you first have to do is uh, for Apache, uh, you have to start it and it will create uh, a port. And now you can go to localhost. So type in localhost and press enter and you'll get to a site. Draft all the code, it all just works. So, n now to link your website to localhost, so search up uh, HT and it'll be ZAMP HT docs folder. Press that, and you have everything in here, right? Well, you need a folder for all your HTML code, so press new folder, and you can name it whatever you want. So, I'll name mine example. Uh, so then you can go in here, and now uh, you can open up a text editor. I use Visual Studio. Uh, um, this is something else I'm doing. Please don't mind that. Uh, so you can just create a new file. So then create a new text document and call it example code whatever you don't have to call it that um so you can open it right and then just write doc type html and then save it as uh example code dot html save it as all files and just keep the encoding the same doesn't really matter and then you can exit out and if you run that it'll well, I didn't write any code yet, but it will run eventually. So now you can delete uh, example code, the text document. And now drag the HTML file into your text editor so you can just edit it. So example code dot, um, example code HTML. Um, so let's see. Put in, wait, I'll, let me put head and I'll put um, title will be, I don't know example that will be my title and now I can start doing HTML. I know I, I think I quoted it correctly and then we can just put hello world okay so we save that right and now if we run it it will work so now we can go to localhost slash and I have to remember the folder name which is example example and if you want to access that specific document you have to put example code dot html which is the url obviously and press enter and it works here's the code press control u and the code will be there and the title is also example so let's see what happens you do localhost slash the folder name only which is example and press enter it takes you here index uh what what you see all that stuff. You don't want it to be ugly, right? Well, this is where you have to create create a new text document again. And I'm going to call it... You have to call... You have to. Like, this is the only thing you can call it. Index. Um, You can just leave it as a normal name first. And just write your uh, doc type. You can just file. Save as. And you have to name it. Index dot html 
and then you have to press uh, all files save it as a all files type and then save that oh then just get rid of that and now there's nothing here yet so but you can drag it into your text editor and now you can um, add title uh, index I'll name it index oops 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 I can't code okay uh, then you do HTML body and then you can just put welcome welcome to the index.html file and you can save it just press control s and now you'll have that so if you go to localhost slash uh, not that. Just go to localhost slash example. Press enter. And I have welcome to the index slash dot HTML file. So let's say you link something to HTML. Um, I'll leave the download for XAMPP control panel in the description below. And yeah. Bye bye. Yes.